Damian, I was uh, born in Romania, and uh, I'm coming from a family of uh, musicians. Everybody in my family is musician for the last uh, seven generations. I originally started to play music when I was uh, three years old, and um, I started playing piano and then drums and then uh, accordion and double bass and cymbal. And uh, by age 10, I started playing the pan flute. And uh, two years later, after practicing a lot of, of the pan flute and studying classical music, I uh, won uh, five uh, gold medals in Romania and uh, I started being considered a child prodigy. <laughs> musician, he's amazing. When I first went in to record with him, I had heard uh, the tracks and played on the tracks. Then, some time went by while we were in the studio before I actually heard Damien play. Then he picked up the pans and started playing. I couldn't believe what I was hearing or seeing. I, it's almost like I had to see it to believe it, and even then, I, it was hard for me to believe what I was seeing and hearing. I, I never heard anybody do what he does on that instrument. It's just uncanny. It's 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 like superhuman. Uh, it just it just on, on that level, viscerally, it hits you as the superhuman ability. But at the same time, he has so much heart and so much passion. I chose a palm flute because it's. Um... First of all, a tradition in my family. I enjoy more the pamphlet after experiencing with all the other instruments. It comes from the same kind of jazz background that I do, but he has like a depth in a lot of different cultural styles that uh, that I never knew existed. And so that immediately earned my respect. His compositions explore a multitude of different styles, including jazz, world music, and classical music. He has a lot of depth in a lot of different areas. I was in Greece and uh, I was playing jazz on the pan flute, and, uh, which is very unique because my instrument is a diatonic instrument and I'm doing a chromatic scale on it by bending the instrument. Berkeley have sent to, to Greece uh, a team. So I played for them uh, jazz on the pan flute, uh, John Coltrane and Charlie Parker and Miles Davis. They heard me and they gave me a full scholarship and they covered for my housing, my trip and everything. And uh, I arrived at Berkeley. At the moment, I didn't know how much I knew. And I got a uh, magna cum laude in nine months. <laughs> does things I, I wouldn't even have dreamed possible on the pan flute, and he's uh, just a wonderfully talented musician. Having this uh, tour last year, the 90 concert uh, date tour, uh, as a headliner with James Brown and Joe Cocker and Shaggy and Cindy Lauper, um, was a dream come true. very direct, he's focused, he's honest, and he's very funny. And he's a hard-working guy, and he's got an amazing energy. Uh, I, he's a very, very unique, original guy. I haven't met anybody quite like him, and um, I, I really think that he's, he's a star. He's a star. I've done a PBS uh, show about four years ago, back in Romania, for uh, an audience of 72,000 people. Music, it can be expressed in many different ways, meaning that uh, if I'm in a good mood, I'm going to compose something that is uh, happier and I'm going to use an instrumentation that makes much more sense for that style. And if I'm in a more of a sad mood, I will uh, compose something that's a bit dark. I, I was just really drawn to him by uh, his vision of this show and what it could be, and uh, I think it's going to be a remarkable experience. I'm real uh, proud to be involved in it.
I would like to do my, my own music to express my music to people and to make them feel a certain way. My biggest rush is when I perform in front of, uh, of an audience. Yeah.